Uh, hello, today I'm going to be going over my fingerprint generator that I made within Blender. All images are from Pixabay, so you should just be free to use them within the constraints of the Pixabay license, which is uh, not very restrictive at all, you know, just can't sell. I'm pretty sure you can't sell the unaltered images. You can sell stuff you use with it, although I'm not sure about that, so just, you know, check out the Pixabay license. I'll throw it in the description. Anyway. So, when you open the blend file, this is what you'll see. You know, just a bunch of stacked blends. If we go into render view, we can see that these are fingerprint textures. So what you want to do is select them all. We're on layer 2 here. This is the second layer. You can press space, randomize, transform. And these are the values you're going to want to have. You know, I mean, you can change them, but 0.5 is going to move them within the bounds of your uh, camera. And then you can change the scale so you can get some variety, but don't change it too much because otherwise it won't re look realistic. Anyway, if we go to layer 1, we can see that here we've got a tileable texture, so we just press F12 to render and uh, change it to repeat image. We can see we have a tileable texture created right within Blender. Anyway, uh, so you can Alt R, Alt G, Alt S to reset all the images. And then what you can do is, uh, if you want to duplicate it, what you do is you'll duplicate collection. That's just to keep it organized. Then, uh, then you can randomize transform, and now we'll have way more fingerprints. So, and that'll just keep it nice and organized. That way, if you want to like uh, delete a collection, it's really easy. So you just right-click, delete hierarchy, and then we have. Uh, half the amount of fingerprints and you can also go into the renderer and, you know, uh, actually I don't know anyway you can play around with it see how things work I'm gonna drop this in the description in a blender artist thread anyway if you have any questions best place to ask them is on the blender artist forum uh, thanks for watching uh, I'll drop all the links in the descriptions see ya